Hi, if you're watching this video, welcome to the hiding in your bathroom and staring at your phone portion of Thanksgiving. You're probably trying to get some relief from your family, and I'm here like the 3 p.m. tryptophan inspired nap to offer you that relief. It comes in the form of slow motion baby videos. <laughs> mm, look at that chubby little turkey. So this is Roy's first Thanksgiving. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He's a baby. He doesn't give a This Thanksgiving is literally just about getting a couple of cute pictures of him with a turkey shirt on. Thanksgiving is a time to feel gratitude and to give thanks. And if you're the father of a new baby, you probably fall into one of two camps. One is you're extremely thankful. You're extremely grateful. Can't believe you have a new son or daughter and you're just so emotional and it's filling you up. The other side is you don't feel grateful, you're not thankful, you're a little scared, you're tired, you're worn out. A lot of dads don't really feel that connection with their baby until their baby starts to develop a personality, and some dads, having a new baby just cracks them wide open and they don't even know what to do. So I wanted to offer all of the new dads out there a special Thanksgiving Day hack. This is an idea I actually stole from a parenting thread on Reddit. It's actually the sweetest blend of technology and parenting that I've seen. Step one, set up an email address for your baby. I went a little bit insane the first couple of days in the hospital. I locked down all of Rory's social media handles, his email address, and his website. What if one day Rory wants to be a part-time DJ, part-time CBD oil salesman? You're gonna wanna go to RoryKaufman.com for all your DJing and CBD oil needs. Step two. Write your baby an email. This is the thing that I loved about this Reddit post. It's a really sweet way to sort of leave a trail of memories or notes or thoughts for your kid that one day they can read when they're grown up. I think it's really cool. Step three, let your child know what you were thankful for by writing them an email this Thanksgiving. Parenting is hard. And if you don't remind yourself about all the little things that make it worthwhile, you can start to feel resentment. Gratitude is a muscle. You need to write down why you're grateful. You need to remind yourself. So here's what I wrote to my son. Dear Rory, it's your first Thanksgiving. This holiday is a time to count blessings, reflect and share gratitude. Your great grandfather used to say this to your grandmother and now I'll say it to you. We're lucky we got you. Here's why I'm thankful you're my son. I'm thankful for your patience. You had rough passage into this world. Your first few weeks, we couldn't figure out how to feed you or help you sleep. You didn't hold it against us. You fought and struggled and allowed us to figure it out. Thank you. I'm thankful for the first traces of your personality. You are already good-natured, even-tempered, and full of light and happiness. You have a smile for everyone from your daycare providers to strangers on the street. Family and friends have noticed that you are a particularly happy baby. I can't know what kind of person you'll be, but I do know this. You were joyful from the jump. I'm thankful for your bravery. You don't cry at the doctor, during long car rides, or when you have a cold. You will cry soon, I'm sure, often and loudly, and that will be fine. But for a baby, you're remarkably brave. I'm grateful, because you remind me to be brave as well. I'm thankful for your tiny grip, your splashing feet in the bathtub. I'm thankful for the little extra scrunch your nose makes when you really smile. I'm thankful that you seem to be the perfect blend of your mom and I. You look more like your mom, which is something you should be really grateful for. I'm really thankful for your mom, who loves you more than anything and has shown great bravery and courage during this time. It must be where you get it from. I'm thankful you made me more emotional, present, thoughtful, and kind. I thought that things would be difficult when you were born, but in fact, it's the opposite. The world is much easier with you in it. Your grandma, Mac, loves a good quote, so I'll leave you with this one from the patron saint of Thanksgiving, Albert Einstein. Oh, uh, Rory, by the way, I'm just kidding. Albert Einstein and Thanksgiving have nothing to do with each other. Don't write that down in a test. Here's the quote. There are only two ways to live your life. One is as though nothing is a miracle. The other is as though everything is a miracle. Be grateful, my son. Practice gratitude. I'm practicing right now. And as always, remember, we're lucky we got you. Happy Thanksgiving, Rory. Love, Dad. Thanks so much for watching Dude Turn Dad this week. If you like this video and you want more great fatherly content, click the subscribe button below. And if you want to tell me what you're grateful for or like what you ate this Thanksgiving, 
throw it in the comments. Now let's get out of the bathroom and go enjoy some turkey. I brined mine in CBD oil this year. See you next week.